the infamous decontamination scene. Seemingly, they infuse some sexiness into Trek, but the characters involved are so not being sexual that it's very discordant. I remember T'Pol being the new sexy girl on TV for a while because of this show. To actually finally see it, yeah, it was kind of uncomfortable. All the hotness that was supposed to be in there was completely gone, and so everything just seemed very gratuitous. They could have had them just sit down for dinner and have that dialogue, and it would have been completely fine. I don't know why they did it the way they did it, other than just to do sex appeal. That's exactly why they did it. (laughs) <laughs> yeah, well, and that's a little disappointing, but whatever. When I was 18, it was just like, okay. The characters were just rubbing each other up in their underpants. That kept zooming in on her back dimples. <laughs> this feels like the future, just in that time frame, and also the context of them being co-workers on a crew, that they're not going to look at it the same way we're going to look at it. That does make sense. I mean, look at RoboCop, right? They have shared showers in that movie. And no one cares. Well, that's Paul Verhoeven. He's very progressive. Yeah, they did that in Starship Troopers too, right? In the future, it's all about joint showers and everything. We won't care anymore. They're in the 22nd century, and they're above just over-sexualizing each other. They can rub oil on each other's backsides, no problem. Then I will counter with saying that is impossibly against canon because of how much Kirk who comes after this, got his, I don't want to say the word dick wet. (laughs) (laughs) He got his uh, phaser polished. Yes. I don't want to sell her short. She deserves more gold encased latinum than we're giving her. (laughs) She does a great job playing a Vulcan with conflicting feelings. Jolene Blaylock has done some interviews where she felt overly sexualized as to Paul. For sure she was. Yeah. They do have an attractive cast with to Paul and the communications officer. Obviously Scott Bakula, that chin. Anthony Montgomery playing Travis Mayweather, the helmsman. There's some scenes with I think his shirt off and he looks pretty hunky. He is hunky. Do you think to Paul is hotter than Commander Tucker is southern oh wow oh wow that's great that's a that's the best question i've ever been asked my entire life we talked about seeing the raisins under to paul's shirt Mm -hmm. but that was like one scene besides that i don't recall there being anything particularly sexual that they were showing with her but trip there are multiple scenes where he's busting out southern sayings In the pilot alone, yes, he's more Southern than she is hot, which is saying a lot. He must have eaten a bucket of KFC before every scene. 